Yeah. What's up, y'all? This is boy. Back up on here. Eat some fries. Uh -huh. Um. I had a white side. Oh, then I want to go to Got rolling up. You have no gas people. Yeah, but again, this should work more. Okay. I ran on some motion. I made another video because I feel that. Going to the club is a fashion show. I'm like, if you ever go to a club, you realize everybody wear their best shit. Somebody will buy a brand new pair of shoes, buy a whole new outfit just to go to one club for one night. Why is that? Who says you gotta be the fast and trendy person to um go to the club? Like there's one day I wanted to wear basketball shorts. Y'all shouldn't. Nigga, I was gonna wear some basketball shorts. This hat. Is that love you're feeling every time the two thousand nine catches your eye? Or is it something more? Or red hat I had. And some flip flops. And didn't give a damn for anybody something. Why I spend that much money on a shirt? Some shorts. Some brand new Jordans. Some brand new socks, brand new hat, but one night, it's beyond me. I got a stuff in there by outfit every day. Not every day. Every time she goes to the club, she buys a brand new outfit before she goes. What the fuck? I ain't got money like that. We in recession. I ain't got money coming at me like that. I can't be buying no Jordans. Hell, I ain't finna buy a brand new hat. Mm-mm. I got a lot of hats. And then I need to buy a whole new outfit. To go to club Miami or whatever club. One night of fun. Everybody's got really check out each other. I mean, they do that. Why do people do that? Like it's a fashion show. That's what I'm saying. Fashion show in the club. Like you have to be wearing some shit that nobody else got. I feel like I'm in high school. Remember when we used to try to outdo each other in high school? You know, if they had the Tims, you try to get some Tims that look better than theirs, or, you know. Right. If you didn't look like money, you want more shit. Maybe somebody don't want to always dress up to go out. I don't. I'll shoot you now. I want to wear me some basketball shorts. Oh, a nice tall t shirt. My little black tennis shoe. A little hat. And then chill. No. Can't wear that. Not in the clothes down here. You gotta be dressing like you got money. And some of these ones that got money, I'm not saying all majority stay home with their mama because when you start getting bills and shit paying lights phone gas rent plus your cell phone bill food 
clothes, and then you put clothes into it. You put yourself on a budget. You be budgeting your clothes. You be like, every time you turn around, you get paid. You try to calculate what you'll have left. To keep money in your little bit of money you have in your pocket. You know what I'm saying? And then a little bit of money if you want to go out. Nigga, I work, yeah, a lot, but I'm not finna go buy a brand new outfit every time we finna go out. I will go to Walmart if I'm gonna do all that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not finna go to no mall and be in there for hours to buy, to figure out what pair of shoes I might wear to please everybody in the fucking club. Who cares? If a chick only wants you because of what the fuck you have on, then that's ridiculous. I don't give a fuck. I'm not worried about pleasing anybody up in that bitch anyway. I got my girl. As long as she's happy, I'm happy. As long as I got roof over my head, and a little bit of clothes I do got on my back that I wear out. I'm oh, good. But spending two, three hundred dollars on the whole fucking outfit just to go out for one night is ridiculous because you want to show everybody, I guess, your swag or whatever that's supposed to be. Look here. I got swag. My swag is me being me. My realness. My passion for life. My passion for making people feel comfortable being around me. Me not hiding who I am. That's my swag. Now if you gotta spend two, three hundred dollars, I'm not knocking you, you do that. If you stay at home with your parents, you know why you spend your cash. And when you get out into the real world and you start having bills and you start having payments and shit of stuff. You have priorities you gotta take care of or you just spend two, three hundred dollars. I mean, come on now. You can shop down. Everybody know about the swap meet. I do. Or, you know, girls go to swap meet. Look at Rainbow. Hello? That is not. That's it. To film say it's the best store in the world. Rainbow. So you can go in there. Get a dress for nine dollars. Or maybe eight dollars if they got an eight dollar wrap. But it does seem like you gotta spend a whole grip of money to please who? And then you might still go home alone. So what'd you prove? You spent a whole lot of money on some shit you probably wear to another club. But you still, it didn't impress anybody. Think about it. It's really that big of a deal to have a fashion show in the club. Not really. It is hot as fuck out here. I gotta work tomorrow. But, I think I'm gonna cut this video short. You know. Because, like I said, I gotta check on the calls, keep checking them. I have a paranoia that um, I be thinking somebody might take my shit out of the dryer. And I know y'all been there. I know you have. Everybody goes through that phase. Y'all, y'all check out the other videos. Got more videos coming with me and my baby. So, yeah. Alright. Peace. <sighs>